check make sure the gun is unloaded. Uh, the takedown is right here. You're going to need a screwdriver. The magazine holds six, so if we top it off, how many rounds would that be? <gasps> You've got actually a striker status indicator here at the rear. You know, at length about uh, the other Taurus and even the other one like this. And they are three dot. They're fairly small, but really the good contrast with the slide, they're easy to see. Uh, but one of the big changes and something that I'm glad they did, uh, they did have a, a trigger lock. When Ruger came out with the Security 9, they absolutely loved it. Ruger kept the price down. The grip is very similar. Uh, has the wider portion and the, where your web, it narrows. Now this gun does have the back strap system, so you can take this out and put a larger or a smaller back strap. BP9CC. Uh, made down in Argentina, which has a really strong firearm industry. Taurus G2C, price $200. All right, let's dive into the Taurus G2C, a handgun that's making waves without emptying your wallet. This compact CCW, that's concealed carry weapon for the uninitiated, pistol is like the budget-friendly superstar of the firearm world, priced around $200. Talk about a bang for your buck. Now, the G2C isn't here to play games. Other than it has a very short reset for double action, also making it a very fast gun to shoot. Actually, it's not. Not than the uh, 26, I don't guess. But I think it's probably a little bit lighter than the uh, 26. Not much. Uh, but one of the big changes and something that I'm glad they did, uh, they did have a, a trigger lock. It's got a polymer frame that keeps it lightweight and easy to handle. And guess what? It's not one of those pistols that'll run out of steam after a couple of shots. Nope. This one holds a 12-round 9mm mag which basically means you've got more shots in your holster before needing to reload. Don't you hate it when sights are more complicated than your grandma's recipe book? Well, fret not. The G2C comes with sights that are a breeze to use, so you won't be squinting and scratching your head at the range. Now let's talk business. Home defense, anyone? That's right. The Taurus G2C isn't just for showing off. It's here to keep things safe and sound. When it comes to reliability, this pistol's got your back like that trusty old friend who never lets you down. To sum it all up, it's affordable, it's compact, perfect for slipping into your holster, and it's got the firepower to make you feel like you've got the upper hand. Whether you're a seasoned shooter or just dipping your toes into the world of handguns, the Taurus G2C could be your go-to sidekick. After all, it's not about breaking the bank, it's about being smart without sacrificing quality. Ruger Security 9, price $300. Let's get down to the nitty-gritty of the Ruger Security 9. This bad boy is a compact 9mm pistol that's giving the Glock 19 a run for its money. And the best part? It won't cost you an arm and a leg, with a price tag around $300. Imagine a pistol that's not just a showpiece, it's got the chops to back up its looks. When Ruger came out with the Security 9, they absolutely loved it. Ruger kept the price down. Kind of long, kind of longish, but not... Uh, you know, not a deal killer. You can see that when I rack the slide, the hammer is cocked, and you can see there the hammer. The Security 9 rocks a hammer-fired slide, which means you've got that satisfying click when you're getting ready to let loose. And don't even get me started on the capacity. This thing can hold up to 15 plus 1 rounds of 9mm goodness. That's more than enough firepower to keep you in the game without needing to reload every other second. Now here's where it gets interesting. The grip. We all know that finding a grip that fits your hand like a glove is crucial, and the Security 9 gets that. It comes with a smaller grip circumference, so whether you've got mitts like a lumberjack or daintier hands, you're in luck. It's like the Goldilocks of grips. Not too big, not too small, just right. But wait, there's more. This pistol isn't just about looks and firepower, it's about giving you control, precision, and comfort all in one neat package. Whether you're a seasoned shooter or just dipping your toes into the pistol pond, the Ruger Security 9 is a solid choice that won't leave your wallet gasping for air. So to wrap it up, it's compact. It's got a hammer-fired slide for that satisfying pull. It holds a whopping 15 plus 1 rounds, and the grip's designed to fit you like a glove. And all this without breaking the bank? The Ruger Security 9 might just be your ticket to pistol paradise. Walter P22 QD, price $300. Let's keep this pistol party going with the Walter P22 QD. This little gem is all about packing a punch without emptying your wallet, coming in at a cool $300. So if you're a fan of the 22 LR caliber and want to step up your game, listen up. First things first, 
this bad boy is all about the accessories. Ever thought about adding a suppressor to your arsenal? Well, the P22QD is way ahead of you. It comes with a threaded adapter, so you can hush up that gunfire and feel like a secret agent while you're at it. Talk about leveling up your shooting experience. Now, Walther did not designate this as a Gen 2, but it is, you know, an upgraded version. Grip is very similar. Uh, has the wider portion and the, where your web, it narrows. And also one cool thing they did, since I have big Sasquatch hands, you know, you can see my hands compared to this little bitty handgun. Now let's chat about the trigger. You know that satisfying feeling when you pull the trigger and it's smoother than a freshly buttered pancake? Yeah, the P22QD's got that. It's like they took all the creaks and bumps out of it, pure buttery goodness. But wait, there's more. Ever held a pistol and thought, man, I wish this grip fit my hand better? The B22QD's got your back. It's got interchangeable back straps, meaning you can customize the grip to fit your hand like a glove. No more awkward angles or uncomfortable grips. It's like the pistol's tailor-made for you. Now, let's talk accuracy. The P22QD isn't about shooting the moon, but it's definitely got some moderate accuracy up its sleeve. You won't be hitting bullseyes a mile away, and for those close to mid-range shots, you're in good hands. To wrap it all up, the Walter P22QD is a 22 lr pistol with a threaded adapter for suppressors, a smooth trigger that'll have you grinning like a kid in a candy store, interchangeable back straps for a customized grip, and moderate accuracy to keep your shooting game strong. And all for just $300? Sounds like a deal that's hard to beat. Smith & Wesson M&P 40 S&W $300 Let's keep the firearm facts coming with the Smith & Wesson M&P 40 S&W, the OG M&P compact model that's been holding its own in the game. And guess what? It won't break your bank either with a price of around $300. So if you're all about that 40 S&W caliber, let's dive in. Picture this. You've got a pistol that's a legend in its own right. The M&P compact is like that reliable friend who's always got your back no matter what. It packs a punch with a 15 plus one capacity giving you more shots to work with before you even think about reloading. Whether you're hitting the range or keeping it close for self-defense, this pistol's got you covered. But wait, there's more! Remember Goldilocks and her quest for the perfect porridge? Well, the M&P Compact gets it. It comes with removable back straps, so you can find that sweet spot where the grip feels just right in your hand. It's like having a pistol that's tailor-made for your grip style. You might like a Glock okay, but you're not going to switch over necessarily just at the drop of a hat. So that's kind of the way it is. Now this gun does have the back strap system, so you can take this out and put a larger or a smaller back strap. And so far I absolutely love it. It's a very well built gun and shoots well, it's accurate. And let's not forget those night sights, a must have when the sun goes down. You'll be aiming true even in the darkest corners, making sure you're always on point. It's like having your very own built-in flashlight for your shots. Now here's the kicker. This pistol isn't just for the everyday shooter. Nope. It's got a reputation in the big leagues too. Law enforcement and the military? Yeah, they're fans. Why? Because this pistol means business and it's built to last. Summing it all up, the Smith & Wesson M&P 40 S&W is the real deal. With its original M&P compact design, 15 plus 1 capacity, customizable grip, night sights, and that price tag of $300, you're getting a pistol that's got the reliability and performance to back up its reputation. Whether you're a pro or just starting out, this pistol's a classic that's worth every penny. Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 380, $400. Here's a pistol that's all about being compact, powerful, and ready to roll. Now, if you're looking for a pocket-sized sidekick that won't break the bank, the Bodyguard 380 might just be your go-to choice. At around $400, it's like getting a premium experience without emptying your wallet. So let's dive into the details. This little guy is a 380 pistol, packing enough punch to make its presence felt. But here's the thing, it's not all about firepower. The Bodyguard 380 is designed with manageability in mind, making sure you can handle it without feeling like you've been in a boxing match. Now let's talk about variations. You know how some pistols are all one-size-fits-all? Not this one. The Bodyguard 380 comes in different flavors, including options with a thumb safety and even a laser. It's like picking your favorite toppings for a pizza, you get to choose what suits your style best. And here's the cherry on top, concealed carry. The Bodyguard 380 was practically born for it. It's compact, easy to conceal, and won't weigh you down. 
Whether you're strolling down the street or heading out for a night on the town, this pistol is your trusty sidekick that'll stay out of sight until you need it most. In a nutshell, the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 380 is your pocket-sized powerhouse. With its 380 caliber, manageable recoil, variations to suit your preferences, and a price tag at around $400, you're getting a reliable companion that's perfect for concealed carry. It's like having a secret weapon that's always by your side. And when it comes to self-defense, that's a game-changer. Canic TP9SF $400 The Canic TP9SF is a polymer striker-fired pistol that's making some noise in the market. Now, if you're all about quality without breaking the bank, the TP9SF might just be your ticket to firearm paradise. Priced around $400, it's like getting a high-value package without maxing out your credit card. So what's the deal with this pistol? Well, first things first, that trigger. If you're a fan of crisp, clean trigger pulls that make you feel like a marksman, you're in luck. The TP9SF comes with a good trigger that's as smooth as your favorite jazz tune. No jerky surprises here. Now let's talk about something a little different, the bore height. The TP9SF sits a bit taller than some other pistols, which might take a bit of getting used to. It's like driving a slightly taller car. You adjust and then it's smooth sailing. But here's the cool part, Warren sights. These aren't your run-of-the-mill sights. They're named after the company that makes them, and they're known for being on point. So you're getting accurate shots without having to squint and guess. And let's not forget the budget factor. The TP9SF isn't just about looks and features. It's about giving budget-conscious buyers a taste of what a quality pistol can do. You're getting a reliable, well-crafted firearm that won't burn a hole in your pocket. In a nutshell, the Canic TP9SF is your go-to polymer striker-fired pistol. With its lethal trigger, unique bore height, Warren sights, and a price tag of around $400, you're getting a pistol that's designed for those who appreciate quality without overspending. It's like getting a front-row seat to the firearm world without having to splurge on VIP tickets. Rock Island M206 $300 Let's dive into the Rock Island M206, a 38 Special Revolver that's got that classic vibe and won't make a dent in your wallet. At around $300, it's like getting a ticket to the revolver party without breaking the bank. First things first, this baby's all about that 38 special caliber. It's like the vintage of the firearm world. It's got that timeless charm that never goes out of style. And guess what? The M206's compact size makes it perfect for those who like to pack a punch without lugging around a heavy piece. Now let's talk sights. The M206 doesn't go overboard with fancy sights. It keeps it simple with fixed sights. It's like sticking to the classics, no frills attached. These sights might not be decked out with all the bells and whistles, but they're reliable and get the job done. Now, don't expect to be hitting targets miles away with this one. The M206 is all about short-range action and recreational shooting. It's like your go-to buddy for a day at the range where you can enjoy some laid-back shooting without the pressure of becoming a sharpshooter. To sum it up, the Rock Island M206 is your 38 Special Revolver that's all about keeping it simple and affordable. Priced at around $300, it's like getting a taste of classic revolver goodness without breaking a sweat. Or your bank account. So whether you're hitting the range for some recreational shooting or just want to feel like a gunslinger from the old days, this pistol's got your back. Bond Arms Roughneck $350 Let's talk about the Bond Arms Roughneck, a budget-friendly pistol that's got that Derringer-style flair and versatility to spare. Clocking in at around $350, it's like getting a taste of the Old West without parting with too much cash. Now, first things first, Derringer-style. This pistol's all about that classic design, like something straight out of a Western movie. It's compact, it's stylish, and it's got that rugged charm that makes you feel like a gunslinger from the Wild West. But here's the kicker, Versatility. The Roughneck doesn't settle for just one caliber. It's like the chameleon of pistols. It comes with interchangeable barrels, meaning you can switch things up and shoot different calibers. It's like having a whole arsenal in one pistol. Now let's get down to brass tacks. This pistol's not just about looks and options. It's about functionality too. Priced at around $350, it's like getting a good deal on a cowboy classic. Whether you're a fan of that old-school style or just want a pistol that's as versatile as you are, the Bond Arms Roughneck might just be your new partner in crime. To sum it all up, the Bond Arms Roughneck is a budget-friendly Derringer-style pistol that's all about that classic charm and versatility. With interchangeable barrels and a price tag of around $350,
it's like stepping into a time machine and adding a modern twist. So whether you're a fan of the Old West or just love having options at your fingertips, this pistol's got it all. SAR USA $400 Time to dig into the SAR USA, a 9mm pistol that's making waves with its ambidextrous goodness and practicality. At around $400, it's like getting a premium pistol experience without giving your wallet a panic attack. First off, let's talk about ambidextrous features. This pistol's got them in spades. From the safety to the mag release, it's like they're saying, hey, whether you're a righty or a lefty, we've got you covered. It's a bit like having a pistol that speaks your language, no matter which hand you prefer. But that's not all. Ever heard of a bifurcated trigger? It's like the cool kid at the trigger party. With a smooth pull and a nice break, it's the kind of trigger that'll have you grinning like a kid on Christmas morning. Now let's talk practicality. The SAR 9mm pistol isn't just for show, it's all about giving you value for your money. Priced around $400, it's like getting a top-notch pistol without the hefty price tag. And here's the kicker, it's a great choice for concealed carry. It's compact, it's easy to handle, and it won't weigh you down when you're out and about. In a nutshell, the SAR USA is all about giving you an ambidextrous pistol experience that won't break the bank. With its bifurcated trigger, ambidextrous features, and a price tag of around $400, it's like getting a front row seat to pistol practicality. So whether you're a righty, a lefty, or somewhere in between, this pistol's got your back, and your wallet's back too. 6 Hour P322 $400 The 6 Hour P322 is a semi-auto striker pistol that's all about that 22 LR caliber fun. At a price of around $400, it's like getting a ticket to a plinking party without breaking the bank. Now first things first, the 22 LR caliber. It's like the life of the party, bringing that easy-going and wallet-friendly vibe. And the P322 embraces it with a whopping 20 plus 1 capacity, so you can keep the fun going without worrying about reloading. But here's the kicker, comfort. The P322 is like that easy-to-talk-to friend you always enjoy hanging out with. It's comfortable to shoot, which means you can spend hours at the range without feeling fatigued. It's perfect for those campfire plinking sessions or lazy days at the range. Now let's talk versatility. The P322 isn't just about shooting, it's about having a good time. Whether you're a seasoned shooter looking for a relaxing day or a newbie just starting out, this pistol's got the features to make you feel right at home. In summary, the Sig Sauer P322 is your 22 LR party starter. With its comfortable shooting experience, impressive capacity, and a price tag of $400, you're getting a pistol that's all about bringing the fun without breaking the bank. So whether you're hitting the range with friends or just want a pistol for some laid-back shooting, the P322 is ready to make every shot a memorable one. Mossberg MC2C $450 the Mossberg MC2C, a pistol that's all about concealed carry and being your reliable partner in self-defense. At a price of around $450, it's like investing in peace of mind without emptying your pockets. First off, when it comes to concealed carry, comfort is key. The MC2C gets it. It's like slipping on your favorite pair of jeans, snug and comfortable. The grip is designed to fit your hand like a glove, and the textured frame ensures a secure hold even in intense situations. But this pistol isn't just about comfort, it's about functionality too. With its textured contact patches and well thought out design, it's like having a pistol that's tailor made for self defense. Whether you're facing close range engagements or just want a reliable option for personal safety, the MC2C's got your back. Now let's talk about that textured frame. It's not just for show, it's like having a pistol that understands the importance of a solid grip. Whether your hands are sweaty or you're in a hurry, this pistol stays put, ready to deliver accurate shots when it matters most. Glock G47 Moss – $600 Of course, let's talk Glock G47 Moss, a semi-auto striker pistol that's all about versatility and reliability. At a price of around $600, it's like investing in a piece of firearm history that's ready for action. First things first, when you hear Glock, you know you're in for a reliable ride. The G47 Moss is no different. It's like getting the trusty steed of the firearm world. With a 9mm caliber and a whopping 17 plus 1 capacity, it's like having a pistol that's loaded and ready for whatever comes your way. But here's the cool part, versatility. The G47 Moss isn't one-dimensional. It's like a Swiss Army knife of pistols, ready to tackle different purposes. 
Whether you're hitting the range for practice, carrying it for self-defense, or just want a reliable firearm by your side, this pistol's got you covered. Now let's talk design. The Glock design is well-known and well-loved for a reason. It's all about functionality. It's like having a pistol that's built with shooters in mind, focusing on ease of use, reliability, and performance. SCCY CPX2, $300. This is a budget-friendly pistol that's all about lightweight performance and practicality. At a price of around $300, it's like getting a reliable partner for concealed carry without straining your wallet. First things first, this pistol doesn't complicate things. It's got a simple design that's all about getting the job done. It's like a straight shooter that's focused on the essentials, no frills attached. But don't let its simplicity fool you. The CPX2 has got some firepower with a 10-round capacity it's like having a solid backup plan if things ever hit the fan. Whether you're hitting the range for practice or carrying it for self-defense, those rounds can make all the difference. Now, let's talk lightweight. The CPX2 won't weigh you down. It's like carrying a piece of security that's light enough to forget about it until you need it. Whether you're on the move or just looking for that extra peace of mind, this pistol's got your back. And here's the kicker, budget-friendly. Priced at around $300, it's like getting a concealed carry and self-defense solution without breaking the bank. So if you're all about practicality, reliability, and affordability, the SCCY CPX2 might just be your ideal match. Bursa BP9CC, $300 Let's delve into the Bursa BP9CC, a pistol that's all about that slim profile and practicality. At a wallet-friendly price of around $300, it's like getting a concealed carry champion without breaking the bank. Now, when it comes to slim-framed pistols, the BP9CC takes the cake. It's like that well-fitted suit that hugs your body just right. No extra bulk, no unnecessary fluff. BP9CC, uh, made down in Argentina, which has a really strong firearm industry. And it feels great. Ergonomically, very well done. It even has a little accessory rail up front. Keep her going. There it is. It resets so far forward I can barely fit my trigger in the tri or my finger in the trigger guard. This pistol is designed with concealment in mind, making sure you can carry it without anyone being the wiser. But here's the star of the show, the trigger. You know that feeling when you squeeze the trigger and it's like a smooth, effortless motion? That's what you're getting with the BP9CC. It's like the pistol's way of saying, hey, I've got your back and I'll make every shot count. Now let's talk ambidextrous. Whether you're a righty or a lefty, the BP9CC's got you covered with its ambidextrous mag release. It's like having a pistol that adapts to your style, no matter which hand you prefer. And speaking of adaptability, the BP9CC doesn't skimp on comfort. With a grip that's designed to fit your hand like a glove, it's like having a pistol that's tailor-made for your shooting experience. In a nutshell, the Bursa BP9CC is your slim-framed companion for concealed carry. With its smooth trigger, ambidextrous features, comfortable grip and a price tag of around $300, you're getting a pistol that's all about practicality without compromising on performance. So whether you're a seasoned shooter or just starting out, the pistol's got the makings of a concealed carry champion, and it's ready to be your trusted sidekick. Taurus GX4XL, $450 The Taurus GX4XL, the pistol that's topping the charts with its Brazilian-made craftsmanship and all-around goodness. At a price of around $450, it's like getting a high-quality performance without blowing your budget. First things first, this pistol's all about that 9mm caliber. Starting with those magazines, you're going to get a flush-fit 11-rounder and an extended 13-round magazine. So in this configuration, it is a little bit larger than the way I have my GX4 Toro set up for carry. It's like the Goldilocks of calibers. Not too big, not too small, just right for all kinds of shooting scenarios. And speaking of scenarios, the GX4XL doesn't mess around with capacity. It's got options, 13 plus 1 or 11 plus 1 rounds, giving you plenty of firepower to tackle whatever comes your way. Now let's talk design. The GX4XL isn't just functional, it's easy on the eyes too. It's like the pistol equivalent of a well-tailored suit. Sleek, stylish, and designed to turn heads. But this isn't just about looks. The GX4XL brings value to the table. Priced at around $450, it's like getting a premium pistol experience without maxing out your credit card. And here's the kicker, accuracy. This pistol isn't just a showpiece, it's a performer. With its good design and solid construction, it's like having a trusty sidekick that's always on target. 
Whether you're hitting the range for some practice or relying on it for self-defense, the GX4XL won't let you down. Summing it up, the Taurus GX4XL is the Brazilian-made striker-fired pistol that's got it all. With its 9mm caliber, options for capacity, sleek design, value for your money and accuracy that's on point, you're getting a pistol that's ready to take on whatever challenges you throw at it. And at a price of around 450 it's like having a winning ticket to the pistol party. Taurus GX4 for $300 The Taurus GX4 is a semi-auto pistol that has gained popularity in the firearms market due to its fantastic price point and increased quality, look, and feel. The GX4 features a polymer frame striker-fired pistol with a 45-degree angle of attack, a short grip frame, and no extra grip length. The sights on the GX4 are not perfect, but they provide a solid sight picture and aren't overdone. Probably is, as some of you see this, especially if you're watching this in the year 2039, right? Check, make sure the gun is unloaded. Uh, the takedown is right here. The GX4 has a standard set of pistol controls with no manual safety or trigger shoe safety. The mag release is small, but the mag drops rapidly. The slide stop is small and somewhat hard to use, but it works great if the gun is empty. The trigger is flat and has a clear wall, but the reset is back to the wall. The Taurus GX4 is compatible with various 9mm ammo options, including Blazer 9mm, Blazer Brass, AAC 9mm, Hornady Critical Defense, Magtech 9mm, and Magtech Round Nose. The GX4 also comes with a range bag, the Lynx Defense Pistol Range Bag, and a range bag made in the US. Accessories for the GX4 include a Glock sight, a solid holster, and a Harry's Holsters Dirk. The GX4's appearance is solid for a carry gun with good lines and design aesthetics. The grip texture is similar to the SIG P320 and P365 XL grip textures. In conclusion, the Taurus GX4 is a solid and modern semi-auto pistol that has received positive reviews from the firearms market. If they continue to release guns like the GX4, they will likely have a lot of success in the micro-pistol market. Ruger LCP 380 Mark II for $300 Ruger's first-gen LCP, or lightweight compact pistol, was a popular handgun that quickly became one of their most popular pistols. The updated version, the LCP Mark II, was released in 2013 with a shorter trigger pull, better sights, and a 7-round extended mag. These changes significantly improved the shootability of the gun and helped Ruger move even more of their pint-sized pocket guns. The updated version is 1 slash 8th of an inch wider than its predecessor, but still smaller than its stiffest competitor, the Glock 43. Both front and rear, a little more meat to them, so you get a little bit better sight picture. The magazine holds 6, so if we top it off, how many rounds would that be? <gasps> The LCP Mark II comes equipped with a much better bang switch than the original LCP and has a more heavily textured grip that helps control snappy yet still fairly tame recoil. The 380 chambering makes follow-up shots and rapid fire a much easier prospect with this gun. Unlike many other pocket pistols, the LCP Mark II is a joy to practice with, shooting well, with new sights being a massive improvement over the originals. The sight radius is very short given its size, but Ruger has wisely designed their sights to be very usable with a relatively narrow front post and wide rear notch that allows plenty of light in on either side of that front sight. In summary, the Ruger LCP Mark II is a small, lightweight carry gun that can be easily hidden away under a t-shirt. Its improved features, such as a shorter trigger pull, better sights, and a longer mag, Make it a great choice for self-defense and competition shooting. The Ruger LCP Mark II pistol has a black-on-black -black sight design, but it could benefit from a differentially colored front post for easier sight identification. The grip angle resembles the Smith & Wesson M and P series, and the gun points well. A comfortable point shooting experience is essential, but it's crucial to consider the hand fit before purchasing. The reliability of the firearm is crucial, as it must fire consistently with a round chambered, making the first shot the most important. Keltec P17 for $200. Keltec, founded by George Kelgren in 1991, is a leading handgun manufacturer in the US. The P17 is a blowback operated 22 caliber long rifle and is a popular choice for those looking for affordable, innovative firearms. Made in the USA, the P17 features a polymer frame and minimalist slide, keeping weight at a svelte 13 ounces with an empty 16 round mag. The gun comes with three polymer mags and a thread adapter for a muzzle device. The P17 uses a reciprocating slide instead of a reciprocating bolt inside a fixed receiver with a zero. Absolutely stellar. 
and uh, I've been very happy with it. You've got actually a striker status indicator here at the rear. Put a red dot on there, you're adding more mass, and the end result could be decreased reliability. 125 inch thick strip of steel slide top and a green fiber optic front sight. The slide lock lever is on the small side, but it is not an issue unless you plan to use it as a slide release. The grip portion of the frame has raised blocks for a sure grip, and a small ridge extends behind the mag release to help locate the trigger finger for depressing the release. The P-17 is a hammer-fired gun with a decent trigger pull, with a fairly long, smooth take-up before encountering resistance. The P-17 runs like a champ with a good grip, sights, and trigger. It has a relatively high bore axis, making it suitable for various shooting situations. The P-17 is an excellent pistol, light, accurate, reliable, and fun to shoot. It has great features like an accessory rail, adjustable fiber optic sights, and a threaded barrel. With its outstanding 16 plus one capacity, the P-17 is suitable for almost any 22 caliber semi-auto, Palmetto State Armory Dagger Compact for $300. The PSA Dagger Compact 9mm is a polymer framed handgun designed for concealed carry and self-defense with a reputation for reliability, accuracy, and affordability. Founded in 2008 by veteran military and law enforcement professionals, PSA has expanded its product line to include complete firearms. The company is headquartered in Columbia, South Carolina, and offers a wide range of firearms, including AR-15 and AK-47 rifles, as well as handguns like the PSA Dagger Compact 9mm. The PSA Dagger was introduced in May 2020 and quickly gained attention in the firearms market for its impressive specifications and affordable price point. It has since become popular among gun enthusiasts and concealed carry permit holders earning praise for its reliability, accuracy, and ease of use. The PSA Dagger comes with a 15-round mag, red dot mounting plate hardware, and a gun lock, but the go-bag style carrying case is well thought out. The PSA Dagger Compact Tactical 9mm is a quality handgun designed for self-defense and tactical use with a 3.64-inch barrel and 6.77-inch overall length. I'd rather start out with a nice, crisp trigger <laughs> to begin with. Yeah. And an overall height without the magazine of 4.78 inches. So the dagger, some of the interesting things about it. For one, some of the sales that they run on these things are ridiculous. It weighs 23.1 ounces and is relatively lightweight for a handgun of its size, making it easy to carry for extended periods. The barrel and slide are made of high-strength stainless steel, while the slide is made of stainless steel with Extreme Carry Cuts RMR slide and features a matte ODG finish. The PSA Dagger Compact Tactical 9mm has a sturdy frame made of polymer, making it highly durable and resistant to wear and tear. The frame also features a textured polymer grip, providing a comfortable and secure hold for the shooter. The polymer grip is highly durable and customizable, making it a reliable and versatile choice for any shooter. Taurus G2C for $250. The Taurus G2C is a budget-friendly, reliable, safe, accurate, and CCW pistol designed to be affordable and reliable. It is a slightly larger version of the Sig P365 and is made of a polymer frame and steel mags with pinky extenders. The G2C is a great concealed carry gun with a 12-round 9mm capacity and easy-to-use sights. It is also a great home defense pistol due to its stellar reliability and 12 round 9mm capacity. And once you hit this wall right here, it's a little bit mushy, but you know, at length about uh, the other Taurus and even the other one like this. If it reminds you of the PT-111, I have no idea why. The G2C is a great choice for those looking to carry concealed weapons as it is smaller and has a pinky rest making it suitable for larger hands. The G2C is also a great choice for those looking to shoot better, as it is a bottom-tier ammo brand. The sights are simple and work well with a three-dot sight and an adjustable rear sight. The tacky grip ensures it won't slip in your hand, making it a great choice for those looking for a budget-friendly CCW pistol. In summary, the G2C is a great choice for those looking for a reliable, safe, accurate, and CCW pistol. It is a great choice for those looking to save money on a CCW pistol, and its compact size makes it a great choice for those looking to carry small loads. Ruger EC9S for $250.
The Ruger EC9S is a budget-friendly concealed carry pistol that offers a 7 plus 1 capacity in 9mm at just above $200. It features a good trigger, a manual safety, and a grip extension floor plate. The EC9S is built upon the LCP success and comes in various colors to suit different hand sizes. The grip shape and trigger placement are impressive, and the beaver tail is modest but effective. These EC9 or LC9, either one, they're very shootable little firearms. EC9S, and that's what the subject is today, okay? I can still get my pinky on, just barely. The backside beaver tail is deep enough. The extended floor plate is a must for people with smaller hands. The EC9S has a pretty standard fare, with a 3 pounds 5 ounces trigger lock. The EC9S shoots well for its price, with a reliable trigger and decent accuracy. The sights are challenging to see but have good gaps between them, making it comfortable to hit targets and manage recoil. The main feature that sets the EC9S apart is its capacity for the price. While some features may seem like a bit of a drawback when considering the cost of the gun, it is a worthwhile investment. SCY CPX2 for $300 a low-cost pistol called the SEY CPX-2 was created to arm as many Americans as possible. It is comparable in size to the Taurus G2C, weighs little, and contains 10 rounds. It is advertised for concealed carry and self-defense, not for duty or range use. If you include the red dot sight, the price is roughly $200 or $300. The SEY CPX-2 can be worn on the outside of the waist, in an appendix, or on the back. Definitely slings them in there, but you definitely got to uh, take some time to get used to that long trigger pull. So, maybe she is broken in now. It's automatic, uh, and it's just meant to be a good personal defense weapon that is very affordable. It sports a red dot grip with finger grooves that aid in holding the pistol steady. However, the grip is not modular. What you see is what you get because there isn't a detachable back strap, grip panels, or anything else of the sort. The gun's overall feel isn't terrible, but it doesn't seem as secure as a Taurus G2C or G3C. Standard iron sights and a red dot with a crimson trace are the two sight options available on the SCCY CPX2. The sights aren't terrible, but the red dot won't work well for self-defense. The housing is made of a polymer and cannot maintain continuous contact with the battery, therefore the $100 improvement is not justified. Side controls are not required. The SCCY CPX2 handgun lacks an external safety, but it does include a well-designed slide stop and a right-side-only mag release. Overall, the gun's ergonomics aren't too bad thanks to the great slide stop, functional mag release, and good serrations on the slide. Bursa Thunder 380 for $250. The Bursa Thunder 380 for caliber semi-auto pistol is a popular and reliable personal protection tool in the concealed handgun world. Developed specifically for this purpose, it is a single-action, double-action firearm with external safety and decocker. The gun is designed for easy concealment and shooting, with a fixed barrel design that enhances accuracy. The rear sight has a broad white outline, while the front sight has a large white dot. The grip, fixed barrel, and good sights make the Bursa 380 a small but accurate gun. When handling the Bursa, one can expect a quality firearm with a small size and heavy weight. The fixed barrel design and large white dot rear sight make it a great choice for those who prefer a smaller gun. But this is a pretty unique variant we're going to talk about. And they are three dot, they're fairly small, but really the good contrast with the slide, they're easy to see. have to say it's uh, moderately uncomfortable to shoot. Um, the Bursa Thunder 380 is equipped with two primary operational safety features, mag disconnect, which prevents the trigger from firing until the mag is reinserted, and the safety decocker located on the left-hand side of the slide. The Bursa Thunder 380 is a great handgun in its size and caliber, offering dependable performance, accuracy, and concealment. At around $240, the real-world price, it is one of the best tactical handgun values available from any manufacturer. However, the company faced issues with quality control during the 2008 presidential election, leading to a decline in quality control. Despite these issues, Bursa has since redesigned the firearms to provide affordable and dependable self-defense handguns. Konik TP9 SF for $400 The Konik TP9 SF is an excellent handgun that shoots well and is enjoyable to use. High-end features include a single-action trigger, a MIL STD 1913 Picatinny rail, and front dot sights from Warren Tactical. 
It belongs to the same TP9 family as Canix TP9EC, TP9SA, TP9SF Elite, and TP9SFX. The Canic TP9SF is equipped with a front dot sight, single action trigger, red bulb indication, MILSTD, 1913 Picatinny rail, and Warren tactical sights. For those seeking the greatest firearm for their money, the Canic TP9SF is a top pick. A polymer striker fired rifle with adequate comfort, dependability, and affordability is the Canic TP9SF. It has a great trigger that is on par with or better than factory triggers from H and K, CZ, and Glock. The Warren sights are a great touch, but the bore height is a little high and the slide looks taller due to the thin back sight. The Canic TP9SF is a great budget pistol overall, but if you want to upgrade or make improvements, read the article to find out which ones are superior. Ruger Security 9 Compact Pistol for $350 The Security 9, a small 9mm pistol by Ruger, was just released. It is a double-stack, mid-size pistol with the same dimensions as the Glock 19, except it fires rounds using a hammer. It costs between $208.9 and $380 and has the same 15 plus 1 capacity as the G19. Other characteristics like a hammer-fired slide and a smaller grip radius may be appealing to some folks. The Ruger Security 9 is a polymer 9mm pistol with a drift-adjustable U-notch safety and a U-notch rear sight. It features a glass-filled nylon frame and slide and has a 15 plus 1 or 10 plus 1 capacity. Although it is accurate and comfortable, a typical criticism was the absence of texture or structure on the forward frame for the thumb of the support hand. Although the muzzle flip isn't horrible, a landing for the thumb would be good. The thumb safety lever is challenging to use and the sights might drift. Aluminum slide rails with a thin, curved barrel make for a potential site of failure with prolonged use. Glock 43, X for $450. The Glock 43X and Glock 48 were introduced at the 2019 SHOT Show as a reaction to guns like the Sig P365. The Glock 43X has a short slide and barrel, weighs 18.7 ounces and stands at 5.04 inches tall. The Glock 43X is a Gen 5 design, lacking finger grooves, front and rear serrations, the Glock marksman barrel, high visibility follower, and extended beaver tail. However, the ambidextrous slide lock is not present on these slimline pistols. In the box, the Glock 43X comes with two standard 10-round single-stack mags, but ETS produces 15-round mags that sit flush with the grip. The Glock 43X does not have mag compatibility, and extended mags designed for the Glock 43 do not function with the 43X. Glock has another variant of the Glock 43X, the MOS, which stands for Modular Optic System. The slimline models lack interchangeable plates and come with the Shield RMSC, which is almost the universal footprint for micro-optics. The Glock 43X is designed for concealed carry and is small, lightweight, and easy to handle. It is a perfect option for a new concealed carrier or a concealed carrier who wants a comfortable gun. The shorter barrel and slide make the Glock 43X a better option for deep concealment and even OWB. However, the longer grip of the 43X may not be suitable for those who want a short gun. The Glock 43X offers a short, easily concealable barrel with a grip that fills the hand. Instead of having a two-finger grip, the whole band can fit on the 43X's big grip, providing more grip, comfort, and control. The MOS series would be a respectable choice for home defense, and the longer grip allows for better control and comfort. The Glock 43X is more accurate than any concealed carrier, but its accuracy is a gamble. The trigger press is stiff but short, and it breaks consistently. The trigger is tactile and audible, and it runs reliably with every trigger pull. The Glock 43X is compatible with OEM mags, shield mags, and ETS mags. Walter CCP for $500 the Walther CCP is a concealed carry pistol designed for individuals with weaker hands and reduced strength. It was released in 2014 and is available in both 9mm and 380 ACP calibers. The CCP features a gas-delayed blowback system, reducing recoil and hand strength required to manipulate the slide. The M2 model simplifies the takedown process, making it easier to handle. The CCP is a single-stack 8 plus 1 capacity pistol with a lightweight slide and an ergonomic grip. The manual safety is mounted to the frame, making it easy to sweep on and off. 
The slide is lightweight and has front and rear serrations for easy manipulation. The big mag release is an interesting choice, but the button works fine. The CCP is a decent 9mm subcompact with a light recoil, easy to operate slide, great grip ergonomics, and a long trigger pull. It has a good reliability rating with no issues with the gun. However, it has some issues with Winchester white box rounds that consistently fail to feed properly. In summary, the Walther CCP is a small, single-stack, subcompact pistol with a reduced recoil system that works well. It is a reliable and accurate 9mm subcompact, but its price point may be a bit high in 2022. Smith & Wesson Governor $900 The Smith & Wesson Governor is a 6-round revolver, ideal for home defense and survival shooting. It can shoot 0.410, 2.5-inch shells. 0.45 ACP and 0.45 Colt and comes with all the necessary moon clips. The governor has two low-profile front sight options, a black ramp sight or a dovetail night sight, and both have a rifled, stainless steel barrel and a scandium alloy frame. The cylinder locks into the frame with a standard release latch on the rear, but it features a spring-loaded ball bearing at the front of the cylinder crane which makes punching out spin cases easier. The trigger is better than most other SNW revolvers, with a single, double action that breaks at around 4.5 pounds in single action and 10 to 11 pounds in double action. The synthetic grip aids in maintaining a full three-finger grip and overall balance. Springfield Armory Hellcat OSP for $500. Springfield Armory has introduced the Hellcat, a micro 9mm pistol with a super high capacity, similar to the Hellion. This Croatian-made firearm is a serious contender in the concealed carry pistol market with a flush mag and 13 plus 1 rounds of 9mm with the extended mag. It features a standard size rail, optics ready and wrap over serrations, and a super high capacity of at least one more round than any other comparably sized pistol. The Hellcat is a single-action Glock with a super high capacity and nearly the same size as a Sig P365. It is compared to the Glock 48, which has almost half the capacity. Other manufacturers are making aftermarket Glock mags to get near the capacity of these new micro-pistols. The Hellcat is designed with optics-ready models, which is a smart move as the future of pistols involves dots or tritium fiber optic systems. The slide serrations are carried up and over the top of the slide for better grip. Other features include a unique sight picture, a flat trigger profile, a reversible mag release, and a standard rail. The Hellcat is a reliable and accurate pistol that would be great as a CCW option. However, it has a price point that is at least $100 less expensive than the Sig P365, making it at least $100 less expensive. The slide release lever is not ideal as it is too close to the thumb's knuckle and difficult to hold down. Sig Sauer P365 Nitron for $600. The Sig P365 is a compact, high-capacity self-defense handgun that has gained popularity among gun manufacturers like Springfield, Smith & Wesson, Ruger, and FN. It features a small, rough texture grip, a hybrid mag, and various options for sights, including factory night sights, front sight, standard metal sights, and various pistol optics. The Fire Control Unit FCU, allows users to swap out different sizes and colors of grips. The P365 Macro, a 380 caliber version, and optics cut are recently released. The FCU also uses grip modules and an FCU, which are similar to most American gun owners' familiar controls. The mag release is reversible and has a positive feel and engagement. The slide stop is located on the left side of the slide and the trigger is part of the FCU. The Sig P365 is a 9mm pistol with a compact design, great lines, and a comfortable hand feel. It stands out from competitors but fits well in a CCW rotation. The aftermarket has taken hold with custom-made grip modules made from various materials such as polymer, aluminum, and wood panels. The P365 is available in various barrels including the Romeo Zero Optic and other well-known brands like Holosun, Trigicon, and Vortex offer micro-red dots that can be fitted to the P365. SIG also produces 9mm ammunition, offering a range of options from 115GR practice ball ammo to 147GR Elite V-Crown defensive ammo. Overall, the SIG P365 is a versatile and customizable firearm for those who value their brand loyalty. Smith & Wesson M&P Shield for $400 
The market for firearms is expanding at a rate that is greater than the growth of the national debt, and strong handguns are becoming more concealable, lighter, and cheaper. The Smith & Wesson M and P9 Shield is a compact, semi-auto pistol that shares many of the same design elements as its bigger siblings in the M and P series. It is barely 6 tenths of an inch shorter in length and weighs less than 3 ounces less than Smith's M and P Compact. The stock of the shield is manufactured to order, and it has a pebbled backstrap as well as an enlarged trigger guard. The Shield 9mm semi-auto handgun with armor knight coating comes equipped with a thumb safety, a clicky safety, and a mag drop safety. The shield is well balanced and shoots accurately, but it has a barrel that is only 3 inches long and a sight radius that is 5.3 inches. However, the front blade is of average thickness, which can conceal too much of the target, making proper alignment of the sights on targets a rather straightforward process. Although it weighs closer to 7 pounds and has the sensation of being heavier, the shield is more accurate than it has any right to be. The ability to control recoil is essential for making quick and precise follow-up shots. If Smith & Wesson were to improve the trigger on the shield, it would be able to take the place of the LC9 as the company's top competitor. And that's all for this video, folks. We'll see you next time.